Hey guys, welcome back. So you guys saw me make some warm chow. So I have to ship a couple of uh, orders and I just wanna show you how I do it. So see the scale is on zero. I put it here and I put it on zero and I weigh here by the pound and then I put it in a separate container so I can pack it up. So this person is wanting five pounds and anytime I send chow, I always send extra. So that's one pound. I still make sure it's on zero. So are you guys enjoying these videos? I love making chow. My worms love it. But get ready, because if you do it in the quantities that I do it, boy, it's a mess. <laughs> but luckily, I do it outside. <laughs> Listen, guys, I tried it inside once. I'm going to see if I can find the video, and I'm going to link it up there. It was a royal disaster. So I got two pounds. It was so bad. <laughs> Like, it was a massive cloud that just went everywhere. I was like, oh my gosh. So, I got three pounds. I always check this and make sure it's right on the thing because I don't want to ever rip someone off because that's just so wrong. And I see people do it all the time and it pisses me off. You know, it's just wrong. I got three pounds there. You know, guys, doing the right thing may not always be the easiest thing. I learned that the hard way. So I got four pounds with one of my jobs. But at the end of the day, I know I did the right thing. And... I'll always do the right thing, even though sometimes it sucks for me. But that's how it is. I know that doing good, I'll be rewarded later. So that's my five pounds, right? So then I always go extra. Because I think it's very nice that people come on and want to actually buy my stuff and I'm extremely grateful for that so here it is here's the chow so this is my next hardest part so maybe you guys can help me figure it out I need to get you think some kind of funnel or something because I like to use these bags. I like these for the fall and Halloween because they look like that witch green. <laughs> Honestly, I just use what I have around. I have a lot of Mylar bags everywhere, so I'm just using what I got. But what do you think of some kind of funnel or, I don't know. I need some kind of, some kind of idea to put this into this a lot easier because I struggle. <laughs> I do. Especially since my hands are not that great. For those of you that are new here and don't know, about two years ago I had COVID for the first time and I thought I was going to die. It was bad. So at the end of everything, after two months, three months of being very sick, I was left with some nerve damage on my hands here, my thumbs. So sometimes my thumbs work, sometimes they don't. They shake a lot. Like, I have trouble picking up things that are flat, like a penny or something. But, you know, um, I do these these hand exercise things, and it makes it better. But it is what it is, you know. I'm not going to live with that bothering me. I still, I still do this. And, you know, when that happened, guys, I didn't see my worms for, like, six weeks, maybe eight weeks. I was crying, thinking of what, you know, what's going on down here. And my family did the best they could. 
but you know i'm a worm mama i i needed to come down myself but i was so weak i couldn't even make it down the stairs so anyway i'm gonna pack these up and then these are gonna be shipped Try to leave a little room at the top so that I can flatten it out. Isn't that pretty? I love this color. Even though orange is my favorite color. I even colored my hair orange with henna. Like I didn't add the other plant to it to make it dark. It looked atrocious, <laughs> but I did it anyway. I love the movie Titanic, so I always said that I wanted to look like Rose. <laughs> My family still laughs about that. So there you go, five bags, five, four bags, five pounds of worm chow. Do you like the sticker? Isn't that cute? I had it made. Next year I'll do a different one. So this is how I bag it up. <laughs> it's no big deal, but you know, someone who's just starting out, like they might wanna know how I do this. A lot of people ship their worm chow in uh, sandbags, and I have sandbags. But when I've done that, I put the worm chow inside a really thin plastic bag, and then I put that in the sand bag. Because even though the bags are made for sand, I'm just scared it's gonna like come out of the little holes. And I would hate for someone to open up a box from me and have it like spilled everywhere. Oh my gosh, that'd be so embarrassing. So I try not to do that. So the Mylar bags, yeah, they're a little more money, but at least I know they're safe. And I got to design my little stickers. I do this on Canva. Canva is an app and you can use it on your phone and computer that you can design all kinds of things. They have a free version that's great. And I used the free version for years. Whew, I'm out of breath because I was running up and down the stairs. But this year I actually um, paid for the membership. It's like a hundred and something a year because with the paid membership, it has so many other things I can do with it. So. I did it and I, I love editing with that so here we go so these are gonna be put in a priority mailbox and off they so go so be sure and like and subscribe to this channel and check out my new channel um, I'm gonna be doing worm stuff on the other one too um, just more beginner things towers just different things than I do here or I just might do everything everywhere you know <laughs> you could tell I've had too much coffee today anyway <laughs> The channel's name is The Composting Worm Lady, and uh, I did the banner myself on Canva. <laughs> I think it came out cute, so go look, subscribe, like, help me reach that 1,000. So YouTube can monetize me over there too, and I could, you know, earn more to feed the gang here. <laughs> so look at them all. So I wanted to tell you, the giveaway on Halloween. Now this is a surprise but I'm gonna tell you anyway. The giveaway on Halloween. You gotta subscribe to both my channels. You gotta say something on one of them. Tell me what you're doing for Halloween and put a number next to your name. I am gonna pull a number, Halloween night live, and oh, should I tell you what the giveaway is? I think I'm gonna tell you, because I can't, I'm really bad at secrets. <laughs> so the giveaway is the worm, the, um pure breed red wigglers that I have in here there are no blues mixed in remember this entire wormery has no blue worms I'm gonna give these 
fat guys away. Look at that. You're even going to get a breeding pair right there. So I'm going to give it away. And that's going to be my thank you to you. Oh, look, another pair for supporting me, my channel, watching all my crazy stuff here and and saying thanks to Joe for everything he does. So I'm going to keep fattening these guys up because Halloween is still like another two, three weeks away. And then someone is going to get these worms. Now, I don't know how much is in here. Could be, I don't know, could be quarter pound, could be half a pound, could be one pound. I'm not sure because my worms are kind of fat. So when they're fatter, it looks like a less amount. When you have a million teeny ones like that, it's a thousand, but they're also very skinny. So I'm going to do that. And you'll have like, um, I think you're going to have to be watching me live and then tell me that, you know, you, I'm going to call out your name and number and tell me who you are and then we'll, um, I'll email you or you'll email me so I can have your address where I'm shipping these guys. Um, okay. So I hope you're excited about that. And I am. It's very exciting. Halloween night though, I will be at work, but when I come home from work, I'm going to be on live that night. So it'll be somewhere between 8.30 and 9 o'clock. All right, guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video. As always, like and subscribe. Go check me out on my other channel. And I'll see you guys next time.